Hello and welcome back to Pixel Profiles. In today's video, I am going to show the unboxing, installation and setup of the Blackmagic Designs Intensity Pro 4K PCI Express Capture and Playback card which I use for 4K full screen real time playback of my DaVinci Resolve 16 project timelines on a separate 4K monitor. Blackmagic Designs Intensity Pro 4K box includes the Intensity Pro 4K PCI Express card, nicely packed driver software and user manual on a SD card, and the DaVinci Resolve Lite Edition on a separate SD card, analog audio video breakout cable, a separate S video style cable. My main purpose of using this card is to get full screen real time 4K playback of my DaVinci Resolve 16 project timelines on a separate, bigger 4K screen. I have been using this card since December 2019 and I am quite happy about the playback performance of this card. Intensity Pro 4K is a PCI Express 4 lane card which is also compatible with 8 and 16 lane slots. I have installed the Intensity Pro 4K card on my Da Vinci Resolve 16 editing workstation on a dedicated PCI Express slot. To install the driver software for the Intensity Pro 4K card, I have downloaded the latest software from Blackmagic Designs website which is very easy to locate. Then I have installed the software. The Blackmagic Desktop Video Setup tool is very easy to set up. It has 5 setting tabs, Video Input, Video Output, Audio, Conversions and About. From the Video Output tab, I have selected the required settings for 4K output from the default video standard drop down menu. For the real time 4K playback on a separate screen, I had to change the settings in the Vinci Resolve 16's preferences settings. There from the video and audio input output settings, I can see the Intensity Pro 4K card for capture and playback use. On the back of the Intensity Pro 4K card, it is quite confusing which HDMI port is input and which one is output, as there is no label for that. But on the packaging box of the Intensity Pro 4K card, there is a clear diagram where it is indicated which port is used for which purpose. Finally, after using couple of months, I am happy with the performance of this card. The high quality real time 4K output of my timelines to a separate 4K monitor gives me confidence about the color playback performance of my projects. Dear viewers, thank you so much for checking out this video. If you enjoyed it and want like to see more videos like this one, please subscribe to the channel. See you soon and have an absolutely awesome day.